The implementation of the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals began on January 1, 2016. 193 member states of the UN are expected to indigenize the 17 goals, which have an achievement date set at the year 2030, with an aim to make radical changes worldwide. The SDGs opens up with you know, removing and eradicating extreme poverty, extreme hunger, and so we know that it is achievable. The expectation is that the funds for the implementation of the SDGs will stem from national budgets of member countries as they integrate its implementation into their national development plans. However, development experts believe Nigeria's 2016 budget will not achieve this feat, especially goals 1 and 2 of the SDGs. And if you look at also the breakdown of the budget, it's definitely not going to address that issue. Because if, you look, if you're talking about agriculture, we need to, we need to invest in the right places. We're not gonna be, it's not investing in structures or, or, or buying of cars or air conditions. We need to invest in the right things, you know, inputs, credits, you know, rural infrastructure, storage. What we see in the budget is that if you look at that vis-a-vis -vis population, the federal budget at least, it's less than 500 naira per capita for the entire year. 500 naira per person. Yes, so if you go at those of the states, it might come up to maybe a thousand or a thousand plus. How do you eradicate extreme hunger with that kind of allocation? In preferring a solution, they think it is not too late to set Nigeria on the right path to fulfilling her commitments. The SDGs cut across education, health, housing, environment, technology, and a lot of other sectors. So if you fund and implement the budget or policies in those sectors very well, you will be gradually inching towards achieving the SDGs. If government is serious about their commitment to the SDGs, they need to do a whole lot more around allocation to the agri sector. Reporting from Abuja, Amadin Uyi, STV News.